Hello everyone. We will continue the topic message class. And in the previous videos, we studied how to give a message type, how to give a error message type, how to give a message which is of error type. Now, in this video, we will study how to give a message which is of type information how to give a information type of message and you will really really understand what is the difference between error message and information message suppose now rather than error i will go for information type of message what is the one word for information it is i i so i gave the type of the message as i same to same requirement, just I change the message type from error to information. I'm activating the program. Now I will just put a breakpoint and show you how information message will be. I'm giving a wrong input to the program. I'll go to desktop 3. Now I'm giving wrong input. I'm executing the query. Size sub RC other than zero because I gave a wrong input. If condition is true and it will raise this particular message. Now, whenever we are raising the message, this is which type of message? This is information message. Whenever you gave error message just we are recalling error message when we gave error message control came out from the program itself it means 20 second was the last line of the program which got executed and after that no further lines of logic executed now we are going for which type of message information message it is not a error message whenever you will raise a whenever you will raise a information message and whenever information message will raise control will not come out from the program the after raising the information message control will continue with the rest lines of the logic of the program this is the most most important part in case of error the control came out from the program after raising the error message but in case of information message control will not come out from the program it will raise the information message and it will continue with the rest lines of the logic of the program suppose I will put a breakpoint on 27 number line and I will show you. You can understand fully. This information message will also raise. Whenever I will go for OK, the control will come on to 27th number line. Now I am going for OK. I am doing F6. Have you seen the information message is raised? Previously, the error message came like this order number is incorrect now information message is coming in the form of pop-up because it is a information message now whenever i will go for ok button the control will go to our program itself because we gave which type of message information message now whenever i will go for ok you can see I'm on which particular line? 27th number line, 27th number line. As of now, there's no data in the internal table. So it will not display anything, but other lines of logic are executing. Now, whenever I will go to execute or continue button, have you seen I'm on which particular screen? Selection screen itself. I'm on input screen itself. You can really find the difference between error and information message. In case of error, once error message raised, after that, the further lines of logic never execute because control came out from the program.
बट इन केस ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन मैसेज आफ्टर रेजिंग द इंफॉर्मेशन मैसेज सिस्टम कंटिन्यूड विद रेस्ट लाइन ऑफ द लॉजिक ऑफ द प्रोग्राम नाउ द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट हियर एज ऑफ नाउ आवर प्रोग्राम इज वेरी स्मॉल एंड वी हैव ओनली दीज लाइन्स ऑफ लॉजिक आफ्टर द इंफॉर्मेशन मैसेज just think about a real project customer ask for information message so we gave the information message after that suppose i have 20000 lines of code after raising the information message i have 20000 lines of code because you gave information message so other 20000 lines of logic will also execute just check how just think how much performance will impact at that point of time you gave a wrong order number information message raised but still we are executing other lines of code why we should execute other lines of code just think how much performance it will impact at that point of time if you gave the message yes in case of information message system will not come out automatically you need to write the logic to come out you need to write the logic that others line should not execute at that point of time in our current requirement we raise a information message that order number is incorrect it means other lines of logic after that should not execute and this is real project i saw yes sometimes what is happening unnecessary 50000 1 lakh lines of the code is executing because we gave information message but we have not written a logic that other lines of logic should not execute at that point of time so it means we need to write a logic to stop this code to execute now it is your wish because it is logic you want to write the logic by any way it's your wish suppose in my current example i will write this logic in the else part in the else part i will write this logic i will cut this logic and i will paste here it is totally your wish how you want to proceed because logic building always varies from person to person i am checking the syntax i am activate now just see how this program will work i gave a wrong input this information message will raise and this if condition is true after that have you seen there is no further lines of code now i gave a right input whenever i will give a right input psi sub r c will be zero so system will go to which part else part and it will display the output it is total your wish how you want to stop the logic to execute sometimes people will go by flag way also it is your wish how you want to go suppose if you do not want to go by this way you can go by other way also suppose same i will just check the syntax activate whenever you have a at so whenever you are raising a message set a flag to capital x it is total your wish how you want to go i took one flag i set it to capital x i am just telling different different ways how you can stop the logic to execute suppose i am saying lv underscore flag type c we all know whenever you are not specifying any length length is one now whenever you are giving a wrong input you are giving a information message and you set the flag to capital x whenever this flag is capital x it means we have a wrong input it means these lines of logic should not execute so i can simply write if lv_flag is equal to space 
and I will put this logic in between and if. So it is totally my wish how I want to go. Just see how this logic will work. You are giving a wrong input. Psi sub R C not equal to zero. It will raise this information message. Flag will set to capital X. It means you gave a wrong input. Why this logic should execute? So we put a if condition. This flag should be space. Done. Our part is done. So this loop will never, never execute. We'll go for vice versa scenario. I gave a right input. Whenever you will give a right input, this if condition false flag will not set to capital X. If flag will not set to capital X, it means flag is what flag is blank flag is space. So whenever flag is space, we need to display the output. So just see it is your wish how you want to go and how you want to stop the other lines of logic to execute because it's a most important point in case of information message, the control will still remain in the program. It does not mean that it will come out from the program. If you want further lines of logic to not to execute, you need to handle by logic. If you are going for error message, no problem at all. Once error message raised, control will come out from the program itself. Suppose if I'll show you the current scenario in debugging mode, whatever the logic I have written, I will run this program. Suppose I'm giving going for a wrong input. If I will go for wrong input, I'm executing this query. You can see size sub RC4. Size sub RC4, it will raise a message. Yes, order number is incorrect. And C control is still in the program. My flag is capital X. I set the flag to capital X. So this if condition is false and this loop a logic will never, never trigger. Just see, I'm here itself. I'm on selection screen itself. Suppose I'm giving right input. I'm giving right input. I'll go to desktop three. Whenever I will give right input, you can see size sub RC0. Size sub RC0, it means this if condition is false. Whenever this if condition is flog, false, flag will not set to capital X. Flag is space. If flag is space, this if condition is true and it will simply, simply display whatever is on our internal table. So we got the output. So it is totally your wish how you want to handle the logic part. So what is the summary of the video? In this video, we studied how to give information message. And information message always comes in the form of pop-up. The most important part is information message. Whenever you're going for information message and clicking on to OK button, Control will not come out from the program. It will execute the other lines of logic after that as it is. If you do not want other lines of logic to execute, you need to explicitly handle through logic. It as compared to this, if you are comparing it to error, in case of error, yes, once you raise the error message, control will come out. Now, in the next video, we will further learn few more important concepts of message class. So that's it in this video. Thank you.